Okay, uh, Beast with a Billion Backs is the name of the second feature on movie, which I'm going to be reviewing. I'm sorry if I'm not very enthusiastic. I'm really tired. Um, didn't get much sleep last night. So, uh, Beast with a Billion Backs. Unlike the first movie, you can't jump into this one. You can't be like, oh, I've never seen the show before. I'll start here. You can't do that. Um, it just really starts, and they expect you to know about all the characters and stuff. Sorry, my characters all messed up. Um, it expects you to already know, like, the basic, like, premise of the show. Unlike where the first movie, where they pretty much explain to you. Um, I've noticed that the first half of this movie has no plot. Um, it's very odd. Um, like, there's no plot. It's just, like, a really long, random episode. And it's funny. It's still funny, but there's no plot to it. Then, the, uh, well, in Comedy Central, they have part one, part two, part three, part four. And part three, the plot finally starts. It's been part one, two, there's been no plot. Plot. Um, the plot is very off the wall and weird. Like, in the first one, it's a very general plot that anyone can get into. Um, but this is very off the wall. Like, you'd have to be a fan of the show to really appreciate the plot here. It's just so weird. I, I really thought it was funny. I, I really like this movie. It's not as emotional. It's more focused on comedy than the first movie. That's more, it's more of a straight-up comedy. Uh, I haven't seen the third and fourth. I will. Monday, they're showing the third. So I'm going to watch that and review that here. Um, it's still very funny, though. Uh, <coughs> but everyone's... I love how the characters are... Like, when Family Guy got canceled and they brought it back, all the characters were like, I don't know, they were like ghosts of their former selves. There's, everyone's still here. Fry's still Fry. Bender's still Bender. Zoyberg's still Zoyberg. Farnsworth is still fine. Still Farnsworth. Farnsworth, by the way, is like probably, I realized after watching the first series, he's probably the funniest character in the whole show. And I never really thought of him like that before, but I'm like, oh my god, Farnsworth is hilarious. Like, every time he opened his mouth, I found myself laughing. He was just great. Um, great voice acting, by the way. Uh, what's his name? Oh, that dude voices like everyone in the show. Uh, he does Fry, does Farnsworth, he does like a lot of other people too. My neck's killing me, sorry. Um, he's just great, he's just hilarious. Um, that guy, oh man, I wish I knew his name, I knew his name just a few seconds ago, but he's great, uh, congrats to him. The, was it the first movie? Let me ask something on the first one. I thought the musical number in the first movie was a little odd. Like, they had two musical numbers in the first movie. I did not like that, I thought they were a little bit out of place. So, I'll make that a complaint for the first movie. Um, yeah, this one's much more straight of comedy. Some people won't like it. A lot of people won't like it. I really liked it, because the plot is just so weird. Um. David Cross is in this. He's hilarious. I thought he was really funny. Um, like, the plot you think you're going to get is not what you're going to get. You're going to get something really weird and off the wall. And, you know, that's that's good. It's like some of the episodes of the show are like that, too. Um, but, yeah, you need to watch either the show or the first movie before you get into this, because it's like, it just starts off. Um, that, like, Definitely recommend this too. This is also very good. Uh, sorry, didn't have much to say. Just that it's hard to review comics because you can't say much, other than oh, it was funny, you know. Uh, I'll be reviewing the third and fourth movie when I see them, which will be Monday, and I don't know when the fourth one comes out. Comedy Central. Uh, definitely watch the show Futurama, by the way. If I haven't said that, definitely watch the show. The TV show is hilarious. 